Hello everyone, my name is Rishi Kumar Jaiswal from IV Professional School. This research project is given to me as a part of SQL assessment. Today, I am going to show you my analysis on Disney Plus Hotstar dataset. Disney Plus Hotstar was first introduced as Hotstar for a streaming service. But after quick growth in streaming service industries, Hotstar was integrated with the company's new global streaming brand Disney Plus as Disney Plus Hotstar in April 2020. These are the topics we will discuss in this project. Case study. This case study comprises of two datasets. The first dataset consists of name of all Disney Plus Hotstar releases, mentioning their title, type, releases, and genres. The second dataset consists of name of actors and directors and the characters played by them in movie or TV shows. Objectives. The aim of case study is to analyze content type in recent years and how Disney Plus can increase its popularity among audience. I have used MySQL Workbench to publish the findings. Data Analysis Analyzing different factors affecting viewership among various age groups on Disney Plus Hotstar. The case study consists of two tables. The first table name is Titles or the table name is Credits. These are the factors that helps to optimize business. Table analysis. The dataset consists of two tables. The first table title consists of movies and TV shows with their details. The second table credits consists of actors and directors with unique person ID. Now, let's see the codes that I have written in MySQL Workbench. First code I have divided into two parts. The first part is content type on Disney+. Plus. On running this code, I get two columns which is type and content type. Let's go to next part, which is content type in recent years on Disney Plus. When I run this code, I get three columns, which is release year, type, and content type. Now, let's move to the charts that will help us to visualize the table. The first chart shows content type. Number of movies dominates over TV shows in Disney Plus Hotstar. The next chart shows releases over years via content type. It is seen that during period of COVID-19, number of releases are high for both type of content. Now, let's see the other code I've written. The next code shows different age certifications on Disney+. Plus. On running this code, we get three columns, which is of age certification, type and content type. Now, let's see the chart that will help us to visualize this table. This chart shows different age certification. G and PG rating is the most common for movies. TVG and TVPG is common for TV shows. Let's move to MySQL Workbench. The next code shows top 10 production countries on Disney+. Plus. On running this code, I get two columns which are production countries and number of productions. Now, let's move to charts which will help to visualize the table. The chart shows top 10 production countries. USA dominates with 1278 in producing Disney Plus movies and shows followed by Great Britain at second. Now, let's move to MySQL Workbench. The next code shows content duration via types. I have divided into two categories which is movies and shows. First, let's do movies. On running this code, we get two columns, which are runtime and number of movies. The next part shows as when I run the code, it returns me two columns, which are seasons and number of series. Now, let's move to charts, which will help to visualize these tables. Duration comparison by content type. The first chart shows movie duration. Most Disney movies releases last about 75 to 125 minutes. The next chart shows shows duration. Most Disney shows last more than 10 seasons, even 20 and 30. Now, let's move to MySQL Workbench. The next topic is and code is for top movies and TV shows genres on Disney+. Plus. On running this code, we get two columns, which are genre and number of genres. Now, let's move to a chart, which will help to visualize this table. This chart shows 
टॉप मूवी एंड टीवी शो जॉनर्स डॉक्यूमेंटेशन कॉमेडी एंड एनिमेशन आर टॉप जॉनर्स फॉर बोथ मूवी एंड टीवी शोज नाउ लेट अगेन मूव टू माई सिक्वल वर्क गेन The next topic is for top 8 common actors of movies on Disney Plus. On running this code, we get names of the actors and number of times acted in movie. Now, let's move to charts which will help to visualize this table. This chart shows top 8 actors acted in movies. Clarence Nash, Frank Welker and Pinto Colwick acted in most number of movies. Now, let's again move to my sequel work bench. The next code shows IMDb ratings of movies and TV shows. On running this code, we get IMDb range and number of ratings. Now, let's move to chart which will help visualize this table. This chart shows IMDb rating. Majority of movie or TV show IMDb ratings falls between six to eight. Now let's see the insights I have got during my analysis. Insights: The number of films dominate significantly on this platform. This may be due to the increasing popularity of the internet. In recent ten years, the number of films and TV shows have increased considerably. More people over the world acquired mobiles, computers, and the popularity of the media content rose. Disney Plus Hotstar should also focus on other age groups like PG-13, TV-14, and TVY. A significant number of films last about 20 minutes as they make short films for children. In case of Source, it lasts more than 10 seasons as Disney Plus Hotstar launches a lot of cartoon shows on their platform. In order to increase viewership. Disney Plus can make shows with shorter season and make more films of duration more than 20 minutes. Disney Plus Hotstar is more family audience oriented. To be ahead of its competitors, they can make movies or TV shows with different genres to attract all type of audience. Disney Plus Hotstar should add good movies or shows with good IMDb rating and produce quality content to increase subscriptions and viewerships on their platform. Bibliography. I have taken dataset from Kaggle and link is given below. Thank you.